Hey everyone, it's Livia. Today I'm going to teach you one of my super simple DIYs that I use almost every day and I absolutely love it and I hope that you will too. So here we go. This is my little sprayer. I just call it my super healing spray. Um, as always, the things that I teach you are not a diagnosis. I'm not curing or treating or anything. Essential oils do not heal you. But what they do do is they give your body what it needs to heal itself. They provide the, the loving, nurturing support for your cells and allow them to do what they do best, which is to heal. So this is what we have. This I call my super healing spray. There's the normal healing spray and there's the super healing spray. And I'll tell you the difference. So here we go. This is a 30 mil, two ounce bottle with a spray top. You can get them at Oil Life. You can get them at Aroma Tools. There's a bunch of different places. You can probably even find them on Amazon. I will put some links in the comments or in the video description, whatever it is. I'll put them down there so you can figure out where you can get the bottles. They're awesome. They're not a lot of money, but I like having you know six or 12 of them on hand. And then I just use them for what I need and I love them. Okay, so two ounce bottle, spray top. Okay, you will put inside that bottle, Melaleuca. They changed the name and it's the scientific name, Melaleuca, is tea tree. So it actually says that on the bottles if you buy a new one, it's tea tree or Melaleuca. This is a five mil bottle, and this is a 15 mil bottle. They, this is the standard, what they mostly come in. So we've got Melaleuca, and we've got lavender, okay? Lavender is really, really good for the skin. It's really calming and soothing. It's really great to help your body calm down and your emotions calm down if you need to sleep at night and you want your body to just be in more of a relaxed state. This is fabulous. You can put it in bath oils. You can put it in foot soaks. You can rub it on your feet at night, rub it on your pillow, and it will just help your body to calm down and to be able to relax. And it's very good for skin calming as well. So I put that in there. And then we have Melaleuca. Melaleuca is also super, super good for the skin. If you have anybody who gets breakouts, like I've got one right here that breaks out like all the time, and I can put Melaleuca on it and it'll go right like that. Um, if you get those nasty sores that happen on the edge of your lip in the corner right here, or the ones on the inside of your mouth, and they pain, you can put one drop of Melaleuca on there and it's like gone by the next morning. So great, I love it, love it, love it. Okay, so I put those in here, 10 drops of lavender, 10 drops of Melaleuca in my two ounce bottle. And then I fill it to the top with fractionated coconut oil. Now, for those of you who don't know, fractionated coconut oil is different than what you're gonna buy at the store. So when you buy it at the store, it comes in a big old tub and it gets solidified. It's great for cooking and it's way healthier and it goes up to like 500 degree temperatures. But fractionated coconut oil means it's been spun and the fat is spun out of it. So it actually stays, you can hear it. It stays in a liquid state <laughs> instead of in a solid. So it's not gonna get cold and get hard and then you won't be able to pour it or squeeze it out of your little sprayer. So this also comes from doTERRA. It's like 12 bucks for this big bottle of it and it lasts for a very long time, depending on what you're making out of it. Love it. And it helps you to dilute your oils. So if you have people with sensitive skin or you have like a big area, if your whole arm is aching or something, you can put a few drops of this and then add like one drop of the oil that you want and rub it all over whatever area it is that you're trying to help, whether it's a sore muscle or something else, you know, an area where you maybe have got a burn or something like that, that it will allow it to help that body to heal and help your skin. So I love that. And that's my phone. I'm sorry about that. I'm gonna put that on silent. I thought it was on silent. Right there, um, I'll call it back. So, okay, so that's what we got. We put 10 drops of lavender, 10 drops of Melaleuca. Fill it to the top with fractionated coconut oil, all in your two ounce spray bottle. And then you just shake it up and I keep it in the closet. So when we go outside and we go for a bike ride and my kid skins his knee, we wash it all up, we clean it, we give it a spray with this. We add some Correctex. I don't have that in here, but it's awesome. It's um, an antibiotic ointment kind of, and it's antibacterial, antiviral, super awesome, heals super fast. So I will go ahead and put that on the Band-Aid, put that over it, and it heals so, so fast. So if they're not bleeding, then we just use this, and I don't need to put anything else on top of it. But if it's a deeper one, then I'll add the Correctex and the Band-Aid on top. Um, this works if you, like if you go and grab a pan out of the oven and you forget your hot mitt and your hand is hurting, you can spray it on there and that will help. Usually I actually just leave lavender in my kitchen closet and I will use it for that type of a thing as well. Super awesome. So that is your basic healing spray. And then if you wanna make super healing spray, which is what this one happens to be, I add 10 drops of frankincense. Frankincense is also super amazing, calming, re restorative for the skin. 
super powerful. I love frankincense in my facial. Like I have a roller bottle that's just fractionated coconut with frankincense and I'll use that on my face and it helps my skin stay beautiful and clear. And this just adds that extra little kick and that extra power to your healing spray to make it super healing, which is not healing of itself. In case you missed the disclaimer before that the spray does not heal, but it facilitates your body being able to heal quicker. And it's really cool because it happens so fast and it takes away the irritation and the pain really, really fast, like within seconds. And it, you don't have to deal with that for days and weeks on ends while you're healing because it just goes so quick and I love it. Very, very worth it to have this in my purse, <laughs> in my kitchen. I have one upstairs in the bathroom. I have them all over and we just use them all the time. And I give them to people when they need them. If you've got little tiny babies, um, you can use this as like a diaper rash spray which I also have used, and it removes the need for desitin, which was like, oh my gosh, that was the greatest heaven sent thing that oils gave me when I first started. Love it. There's so many, so many uses for this, and I look forward to seeing you on the next video. I'll leave all the links and comments on the oils and the links where you can learn more about each individual oil, as well as where to get your bottles in the description. Okay, bye.